Hi guys, this is Pooja and welcome back to my YouTube channel. People often ask me for book recommendations that they can buy for themselves or for their friends and family. This comes at the right time because Christmas is around the corner and we must be scrapping for gifts for our friends, families, colleagues, secret Santa. Um, Personally, for me, whenever I have received a book as a gift, it has been a great compliment and a reflection for my friendship with that person because that means they want to add something more to my life by gifting me that book. And I've done the same for a lot of my friends. Uh, books that have added value to my life, I'd like them to read and take the same kind of meaning from it and have um, have a growth in their life so that's what books as gifts mean to me so i thought why not i uh, come down with my list of books that make up as good gifts and it might help you guys add a, a one or two uh, in your shelf as well right so without much ado let me get started with it so the first book that i'll recommend is brit marie was held by frederick backman from the blurb it says that at the first sight, Brit Marie is a fussy, passive-aggressive busybody. But hidden inside her is a woman who has bigger dreams and a warmer heart than anyone around her imagines. So this is a very warm and nuanced uh, book, uh, as you can see, and very interesting. Frederick Backman is one of those authors that write very warm, fuzzy um, characters and books around situations that are uh, not ideal but then at the end you find some silver lining out of it so i would recommend other books by the author as well do give this one a try uh, then the second book is uh, we cannot complete this list without adding a classic classics are very good to gift uh, because you can also find a lot of first edition in second hand bookshops and actually this one was a gift to me as well this is a first edition and um, it's uh, it's a book by agatha christie they do it with mirrors i have not read this one but because this was gifted to me and i personally like secondhand books uh it it was the perfect gift for me uh, other Agatha Christie books are also very nice around this time. Uh, they are perfect thrillers, they are classics, they are not very expensive as well. So they they can make up for a very good gift. So uh, please have them. The third book that I have is this book in Hindi. Bahut Dur Kitna Dur Hota Hai by Man of Call. If you know someone who likes Hindi literature or have been off the bandwagon and they want to get back to it. This makes up for a very good book. It is poetic and it has elements of travel and it is written in Hindi. This was one of those books that got me back into reading more of Hindi literature and it has been a treasure to keep ever since. So I recommend other books by the same author too if you want to try them out for yourself but do add this to the list of gifts you can pass it along. The fourth book that I have is one of my favorite books again. This is Normal People by Sally Rooney. Interestingly enough, I got this copy from another friend as a gift because they were not reading it anymore. Uh, and I really thoroughly enjoyed it because it is a very nuanced, again, a very nuanced story about relationships. It's not a very normal relationship. The characters are extremely flawed. It is a modern love story, which is what makes it more interesting as well. It's composed of a lot of dialogues between the two characters and how their life uh, situations take them away from each other, but then bring them together and they, uh, grow as a couple and two people. Uh, it is a small read and very wholesome, uh, just about uh, finding silver linings in life and falling back to people that really care about you. So do add this to your list. Okay, the fifth book that I have is, I have to have to add like a fantasy read to it. And one of the most popular authors in this genre is Neil Gaiman. Uh, this is a book by Neil Gaiman, The Graveyard Book. It's very spooky and it is very Halloween-ish. Uh, 
I hope I pronounced that okay. Uh, but from the blurb, it says, nobody wins. Known to his friends as Pod is a normal body. He would be completely normal if he didn't live in a graveyard being raised and educated by ghosts. Right off the bat, the blurb is very interesting and it is thrilling in its own different ways because it has uh, elements of mysticism and magic. So why would you not like to add this as a gift for this Christmas, right? Um, so hi, I do recommend this one. The last book that I have to add is Crazy Rich Asians by Kevin Kwan. Uh, I'm pretty sure you would have come across this name because there is a very popular movie made adapted from this book. Uh, the premise is of a typical romantic story but add to it uh, there is this rich family and when the two protagonists get back to Singapore to get married, that's when the girlfriend realizes how rich the boyfriend is. Uh, it's very fun. It has a lot of drama in it. Uh, perfect for someone who loves drama, right? We all love drama. Uh, and they want to get back into some holiday reads with the, which is fast paced, but also is like a page turner. Uh, so, and also the, uh, because this has elements of Asian culture peppered in like how in India we have big fat Indian weddings so similarly there is like the premise of the book is on the wedding which is supposed to be very grand and it's very thrilling it's interesting so uh, it would make up for a very good book you can also add this as a buddy read you can get it for yourself for your buddy and uh, you can read it along with them so yeah there you have it I added, I have like six books to the list of books that you can gift to your friends, family, peers, anyone you can find on the road maybe. And I hope you guys like this video. If you have more suggestions to add to the list, please add in the comments below and um, let me know how you like this video and this list. I will see you guys next time. Bye.